In this video, we're going to show you the HVAC equipment sheet within the HVAC and plumbing estimating spreadsheet from the MEP Academy. We'll show you how to record the vendor quotes, how to labor the equipment, and how to check the metrics, things like cost per ton, cost per CFM. Okay, this is your HVAC equipment sheet. So what you'll do is take off all the equipment shown on the equipment schedules of your drawings and list them here. You can, you can put the tag numbers, AC1 through, let's say, AC5. Uh, let's say they're 10 ton units with roof curbs and economizers. Let's say you have five of them, right? And then you put how long it's going to take to install each. Let's just say 12 hours and We'll have the uh, piping guys there, start and test, we'll put two, balance, one, whatever. Whatever your typical hours are, put them here, and it'll multiply it out based on your quantity. So you can see we ended up with 60 hours of sheet metal, 20 hours of piping, and start and test, 10 hours, and five hours, that's for five units. Over here you got space for five quotes, five vendors, usually at least to get three. Let's say this vendor bid 35,000, so you see right away it carried 35,000 because it's the only bid. If you put 36,000, it's still going to carry 35,000 because it's the lowest. If I put a one lower, let's say this guy bid 30,000, then you'll see it'll pick the lowest one unless you put a number in here. It'll carry whatever you put in here. If I put 28,000 in here, then it'll carry that, 28,000. So let's say we're just going to use the 30,000. So if this, if this has a zero in it, it's going to carry the low one here. So over here you can check your parameters. So let's say those 10 ton units has, there's five of them. So let's say that's 20,000 CFM. So right away it tells you you're paying $1.50 a CFM for those units. And then the tons, you've got five times 10 tons you have 50 tons. So it tells you you're paying $600 a ton. And then if you want to see how much you're paying each, because they bid you a lump sum, 30,000, you're getting five units. So they're charging you 6,000 a unit, 600 bucks a ton, and $1.50 a CFM. So this is a quick parameter that is available on each one of the equipment sheets. There's plenty here for you to take off all the equipment on the project. This back to button will jump you right back to the top and you'll see. So if you want to clear these out, don't put a zero. If you put a zero, it's going to carry zero because zero is the lowest value. When you want to remove these values, just right click and clear contents. That's the proper way to do it. So then it carries whatever's put in here. So that's what this reminder is here. Clear contents. Use right click clear contents.